When you try to print from Mac OS, you may occasionally get a strange error that says your printer's encryption credentials have expired. This error usually occurs after installing the latest macOS version. It seems that new macOS versions don't always trust old encryption credentials. Let's discuss what you can do to get rid of this problem and restore your printer's functionality. Reinstall the printer using the AirPrint protocol. The quickest way to get rid of the encryption credentials have expired error is to reinstall your printer. This error often occurs when an AirPrint driver is installed and set as secure AirPrint. The credentials for their respective driver expire after a given period, which makes the user unusable. So first, on your Mac, go to System Preferences, then select Printers and Scanners. Locate and select your printer in the list, then hit the Remove button. Click on Delete Printer to remove the device. Navigate to Library, Printers, and drag your printer folder to Trash. Empty the Trash folder. Turn off your Mac and unplug your printer. Then, restart your devices and go back to Printers and Scanners. Find and install your printer, but this time change the driver from Secure AirPrint to AirPrint. Another is, reinstall the printer under the LPD protocol. Other users confirmed they solved the problem after reinstalling the printer using the LPD protocol. If you already installed the printer via AirPrint but it's not playing nice with your Mac, switch to LPD and check the results. If you use an older printer, this solution may be the answer to your printer-related problems on macOS. So navigate to Applications and select Utilities. Then, launch the Printer Setup Utility. Click on the plus sign to add the printer. Then, go to IP tab and select LPD from the protocol list. Then, enter your printer's IP address, add a name for it, and hit the Add button. If the issue persists, try resetting your printer network settings. First, unplug your router and leave it powered off. Then, restart your printer. On your printer, go to Control Panel and select Setup. Go to Network Setup and select Restore Network Settings. Then power off your printer. Wait for 30 seconds and plug your router back in. When your network connection is back, power up your printer. Launch your printer's wireless setup wizard. If the error persists, go to your Max Printers and Scanners section and reinstall the printer as shown previously. So, basically, you're going to reset your printer network settings and then reinstall the device. You can also try to generate a new self-signed certificate using your printer's embedded web server. You can use your printer's homepage to manage printer-related settings, install updates, and so on. So, get your printer's IP address and enter it in a new browser tab. Press Enter to open the EWS page. Go to the Network tab, then go to Advanced Settings and click the plus sign. Select Certificates and click on Configure. Select Create a new self-signed certificate. Hit Finish and let the printer generate the new certificate. Check if the error is gone. Note: On some printer models, there are no advanced settings. Click directly on Configure Certificate and add the new certificate. For step-by-step -step instructions on how to generate a new self-signed certificate, go to your printer manufacturer's support page. Do these solutions help you fix a problem? Which of these methods worked for you? Let us know in the comments below.